On April 7, 2014, President Obama signed the Cooperative and Small Employer Charity Pension Flexibility Act into law. The act provides about 30 not-for-profit sponsors of multiple employer pension plans, like Electric Co-op's Retirement Security Plan, with a permanent exemption from certain volatility and costly provisions of the 2006 Pension Protection Act. Those provisions were designed to reduce the risk single employer plans or plans that cover only one company's employees pose to the government if that company went bankrupt and terminated their pension plan with insufficient assets. But the NRECA, RS plan, and other multiple employer plans like ours do not present the same risk as those single employer plans. Our plan includes more than 880 participating co-ops and 55,000 active employees spread across 47 states. We work together to keep our plan healthy, taking collective actions like the recent RS plan prepayment program that increased funding by almost $1.8 billion. Through key partnerships with legislators and constant collaboration with our member cooperatives and employees, NRECA was able to demonstrate this cooperative difference to Congress. And that resulted in the Cooperative and Small Employer Charity Pension Flexibility Act. This is the first standalone piece of national legislation championed by NRECA and enacted into law in over 20 years. This bipartisan effort was led in the Senate by Democrat Tom Harkin of Iowa and Republican Pat Roberts of Kansas, and in the House of Representatives by Republican Susan Brooks of Indiana and Democrat Ron Kind of Wisconsin. Now, our retirement security plan is fully exempt from the costly PPA funding rules and other requirements that could have caused a rapid acceleration in funding requirements and additional cost volatility. The Act doesn't eliminate the possibility of any future cost increases, but it does allow us to spread cost more reasonably, avoid extreme cost increases, and better maintain the RS plan for both current and future electric co-op employees. Thanks to our member co-ops, our strong bipartisan supporters in the House and Senate, and President Obama for their roles taking this critical step toward a strong and secure future for Co-op Nation.